Fuck you, so dudes, you're fucking badass. Thank you for coming. Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News, and this is your Maximum Threshold Rock and Metal News Report. Metallica drummer Lars Ulrich appeared on the March 31st episode of Join or Die with Craig Ferguson on the History Channel. Lars discussed what is the, quote, most influential band, unquote, in a heated debate with Tom Papa and Alan Light. You can check out a clip on YouTube now. And Childbite are streaming their new album called Negative Noise in full at New Noise Magazine com for a limited time. Phil Anselmo produced the album, which will be out through Housecore Records. And Rob Zombie guitarist John Five has released another music video for a new track called Now Fear This. John Five and the Creatures' new album called Guitars, Tits, and Monsters will be released later in 2016. Continuing with your Maximum Threshold.net rock and metal news, and Cifram are changing their lineup a bit. Keyboardist Emmy is leaving the band, and electric accordion player Netta Skog is now a permanent member in the band. In Cifram stated, Many fans have asked in recent times where Emmy is at our shows. We can now confirm that due to family reasons, she will be stepping aside from keyboard duties, with Netta Skog continuing as a permanent member of Cifram, bringing her electric accordion to the stage. And Vector are streaming a new song called Pillars of Sand on YouTube. It's off their new album, Terminal Redux, which is out on May the 6th through Earache. And finally, Bullet For My Valentine have announced that they've signed a new worldwide deal with Search and Destroy Spine Farm. Mark Tuck, uh, pardon me, Matt Tuck stated, we're very proud and excited to announce our signing to Search and Destroy Spine Farm Records. It feels great to be part of a family that truly believes in the band and is ready to take us to the next level. It's been an incredible journey so far, but with the Search and Destroy Spine, Spine Farm team behind us, it feels like we've just begun. Here's to the future. So, uh, the good future coming up for Bullet for My Valentine. All you fans out there, get ready for some new albums. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News with a Z. And this has been your Maximum Threshold Rock and Metal News Report. Thanks for tuning in.